Are you on the hunt for a home or property in Vera Beach, Florida or the surrounding area? Then this video is for you. I'm gonna take you through what you need to know if you're searching for a Vera Beach home or property. Where do you start? Who should you trust? What services are available? And why you may want to consider one area over the next. Also, let's figure out if Vero Beach is really where you wanna live. Give this video a watch. And if you'd like us to help you and your family, give us a call. So you're interested in looking for a home in the area. The first thing you should do is figure out what you want. What I've always advised my clients to do is to make a list of what you first need in a home or community, i.e. do you need to see a certain health specialist for your asthma or do you require physical therapy or close proximity to a hospital? Do you travel for work and need access to an airport or a major highway? Do you have a dog that requires a fence in the yard? You get the gist. What are real necessities that cannot be lived without? And then you need to make a list on what are your wants? What do you desire to have access to if you could, like your preferences? Um, and a good place to start here is to consider your hobbies. Like what do you enjoy doing or what would make your life better if you had access to it or you could do it? Like, do you enjoy to soak in a hot tub in the evenings after work? Uh, like you don't need it, but it would be really nice if you had a space on the patio to put one eventually, that kind of thought process. Then once you have those lists made, do some digging. Let's find out about Vero Beach as much as you can. Watch my other YouTube videos. Heck, watch any YouTube videos you can find on the area and consider if this city and area will provide for your needs and your wants. What we wanna know here is, will you be happy in Vero Beach? And if you determine that the answer is yes, then great. You're on your way to owning a slice of this paradise. Now, you need to find someone to help you search for a place. I would recommend using a realtor versus searching on your own based on the fact that in our area, the services of a realtor are going to be essentially no cost to a buyer in a real estate transaction. So you get an additional set of eyes and ears to help you search. You get contract and legal representation and compliance. Uh, you get coordination of your purchase transaction and all of the hoops that have to be jumped through and all of the deadlines that have to be net met, access to trusted vendors and other professionals in the area, all essentially for little to no cost to you. The only realtor costs that get charged on the buying side of a purchase are transaction or broker fees, which end up being a couple hundred dollars for hours upon hours of someone else helping you with the numerous parts of coordinating everything to come. It's more than worth the expense. You also need to recognize that not all agents are cut from the same cloth. Not only do people just have different personalities, that's a given, but we also have a different skill set, level of experience, standard of customer service and care, and different processes for how we help a client and work with all parties through a successful transaction. In our area, it's not typical that we have traditional buyer's brokers uh, with a signed agreement between a buyer and their representing agent with a binding fiduciary duty but that is available to you if that is what you require to be most comfortable. My experience is that it limits a realtor in their ability to communicate and negotiate with other parties because it opens up an agent to a lot more liability altogether and is not always in the best interest of getting the deal done. In our area, it is very commonplace that an agent will act as a transaction broker with an obligation to represent their client's best interest in all communications and negotiations with an emphasis on helping to make sure the transaction or the deal comes together successfully. It's a nuance, but it allows for better communication between parties, and it is something that you need to know about um, if you are planning to purchase with the assistance of a realtor in Florida. Some realtors are single agents and some have teams. Most brokerages offer minimal services to their clients on the buying side. Maybe a nice office environment that you'll visit on your initial meeting with your agent, but not usually more than that. 
we find that it's really the individual agent's activities and communications that make the biggest impact to one's experience. Some agents and teams also offer the services of a transaction coordinator, which helps everyone facilitate an easier closing. They make sure to coordinate with all parties involved, take note, and hold everyone to the important dates and deadlines of the purchase contract. They take care of the legal paperwork compliance with the brokers and title companies. They help coordinate inspections, repairs, and other vendors that are needed. They really keep everybody updated on the, pro uh, the process and the progress for that 30 to 45 days while you're under contract um, and working to close on the property or the home. So who you work with really does matter and will make a world of difference. You should spend a considerable amount of time finding an agent that speaks to you and can offer a high level of service and representation to you. Once you find them, you'll want to have them help you narrow down the best areas for you to focus on when searching for the type of home that will fit your needs and your wants. Your agent will be able to help advise on what areas and neighborhoods will be the best match for your family because like anywhere, Vero Beach has many different areas that have their own flair and their own flavor, their own aesthetic and different types of homes. For example, some neighborhoods may be more active or mixed ages, better for families with small children. Um, some might have larger lots or no homeowners associations. Some might be great for uh, seasonal ownership or retirees and so on and so forth. So if you're looking for homes in Vero Beach and you have happened upon this video, if this information is helpful to you, give us a call because that's just the tip of the iceberg in terms of what we can provide you and advise you on during your house hunt. And we pride ourselves on our high level of client care. You can always check out my other videos on this channel. I also have a playlist all about Vero Beach with all of those great informational videos. And you can also find us on Google, the Carroll Home Team, Vero Beach Realtors, and check out all of our awesome five-star reviews. We currently have over 150 of them. Calling us does not obligate you to buy a house or even work with us, but it does start you in the right direction for finding your right home here and getting connected to a team of excellent, highly motivated full-time realtors who strive for excellence in what we do. So give us a call and go click that subscribe button before you forget.